Day learners, welcome to our day one. Sources of light, natural and artificial. What gives us light? Which of these things give light on their own? Can all objects produce light? Why do we need light? Today, we will learn that some sources of light come from nature, while others are made by people. What is light? Light is something that helps us see things around us. Without light, everything would be dark. Two kinds of light sources. We classify the sources of light into two groups. First, natural sources of light. These are light sources found in nature. They are not made by humans. Examples, sun, the main source of light on earth. Lava, stars, lightning. Always remember, the moon does not produce its own light. It only reflects the light of the sun, so it is not a natural source of light. Artificial sources of light. These are man-made. People create or invent them to give light. Examples, light bulb, flashlight, candle, cell phone screen, car headlights, lamp. Let's try this. Clap three times if it is a natural light. Clap once if not. Light is essential for seeing. The sun is the biggest natural source of light. Some light sources come from nature, while others are man-made. Artificial light helps us at night or when it's dark. Let's try this. Draw four natural and artificial sources of light. Welcome to our day two. How light helps us see things. Close your eyes. Open your eyes. Close your eyes for five seconds. Now open your eyes. What changed? Was it easy or hard to see anything when your eyes were closed? Why can you see everything after opening your eyes? What do you think helps your eyes see the things 
around you. Without light, our eyes cannot see anything. Today, we will learn how light helps us see. Why do we need light? Light allows our eyes to see objects. When light hits an object, it reflects back to our eyes. That reflection is what helps us see. How light helps us see. There are three things needed for us to see. Light source, like the sun or a lamp. Objects. Examples, book, pencil, or toy. Eyes to receive the reflected light. Process of light. Light shines on an object. The object reflects the light. The reflected light enters our eyes. Our brain helps us understand what we see. Without light, we cannot see anything. Let's try this. Choose the letter of the correct answer. What do we need so our eyes can see objects? Without light, we see Which one is a source of light? Light helps us see objects because it... What happens to objects when there is no light? Light makes seeing possible. Without light, everything looks dark or invincible. We need light every day to stay safe and understand our surroundings. Let's try this. Write true if the statement is correct and false if not. Welcome to our day three, how light travels. How light travel. Watch and observe how light travel.
Did you notice the beam of light? How the light travels. Today, we will learn something amazing. Light travels in straight lines and in all directions from its source. What is light? Light is a form of energy that helps us see things. Without light, everything would be dark. Where does light come from? Light comes from a source such as the sun, lamps, flashlights, candles. How does light travel? Light travels in straight lines. You can see this when a flashlight creates a straight beam. Sunlight shines through a small window and forms a straight line on the floor. Light spreads out in all directions from a source. You can see this when a light bulb lights up the whole room, not just one spot. Light help us see the world around us. Light travels in straight lines. When light is blocked, a shadow forms. Let's try this. Choose the letter of the correct answer. Light travels in... Which of the following is a source of light? When something blocks light, what is formed? Where does light from above go? What helps us see things? Let's try this. Write true if the statement is correct and false if not. Welcome to our day four, light and opaque objects. What do you think will happen if I shine this flashlight on this book? Can the light pass through? Today, we will learn about opaque objects and what happens when light hits them? What are opaque objects? Opaque objects are things that do not let light pass through them. Examples, book, wall, Pencil box, chair. What happens when light hits an opaque object? Light cannot pass through the object. A shadow is formed on the side opposite the light. The shadow has the same shape 
as the object blocking the light. Why do shadows form? Shadows are formed because opaque objects block light. Let's try this. Choose the correct answer. What happens when light heats an opaque object? Which of these is opaque? What is formed behind an opaque object when light hits it? Shadows have the same blank as the object blocking the light. Light cannot pass through which type of object? Opaque objects do not allow light to pass through. Shadows are formed when light is blocked. Light always travels in straight lines, and shadows help us see where light is blocked. Let's try this. Write true if the statement is correct and false if it's not. Thank you for watching. Till our next science lesson. Goodbye.